Well, hi, you guys. I'm Denise with Artist at Heart. I'm a certified art teacher and artist. I love these new products by Gravy. I just got them and I am in love. So first of all, look at how cute these are. This is 100% cotton, 24 watercolor postcards in this pretty pink box, okay? So here, right here is the postcard and I already did one of my watercolor paintings. So the other side is white and then the, this side you can put your address on and your stamp and then keep the rest of the pretty little watercolor postcards in your nice box. So I'm going to set this over here for right now. Okay. And okay. Look at how pretty these are. <laughs> and I'm, I'm usually using acrylic paint. So I was excited to try these when I got them. There's a plastic layer in between to keep them neat and tidy. Look at those colors. Is that gorgeous? Oh my gosh. So, and it comes in this pretty little tin right? So the tin has this nice closure. All right. So I'm going to open it back up. I'm going to show you guys up close all these colors. It also comes with a pencil for drawing and these watercolor pens. Look at the colors. Oh, they're so pretty. All right. I'm going to show you how easy and fun they are to use. Okay. So first of all, when you get the pen, it doesn't come with the water. So all you have to do is unscrew it right here and fill this part up with water and then re-screw it and then it has a cap, okay? So even though the cap, the tip is already stained with the watercolor paint, it doesn't come out that color. It'll still come out clear because I did try to wash it afterwards and again, the watercolor stays in the tip and you have three different sizes. So this one's fine. I would call that medium and then I would call this one this is like a flat bristle. See that? I used all three on this painting. They work great. I'm going to do it with you guys today real quick. Okay, I'm going to cap those back up. Let's go with this one. And again, to get it wet, all you have to do is give it a little squeeze here on the handle. It's pretty easy to use. And I'm just going to, I don't know, start with Super pretty colors, right? Are these not beautiful? Let's go with some yellow. So again, I'm squeezing the water a little bit and I'm getting the watercolor paint on my brush. I'm not going to draw anything out. I'm just going to kind of paint and show you guys how beautiful it is. Look at that. Now, if you want it more watery, I'm just squeezing the handle here. It's really easy to squeeze. So it works really well. I'm very impressed. I would have loved to have these with my students. That's for sure. Um, I just found out about it. I'm like, oh, these are really, really nice. Now I'm going to switch. I'm going to try more of an orange. So I'm just going to go right over here. You only need a little bit. Look at that. Blends beautifully. You can blend the colors together. Again, if I want it more transparent, I could add more water to it. What's really nice about this watercolor paper too is it's not buckling so look at all the paint that i used on this and it didn't buckle at all do you know what i mean so it didn't get wavy it's a really nice quality cotton watercolor pa paper all right let's go into a little bit of red what do you think let's use this bright red over here the colors of these you guys are magnificent i love them and what again what's really nice is that it's a small little container. So if you travel, I love to travel. And I actually do like to uh, bring my set with me because it relaxes me on an airplane, on the beach. So this is really, I just got it. So I'm excited to take it on my next trip. But I always bring a sketchbook with me when I'm traveling. Again, this is just something really easy to carry, really easy to throw in your purse. Or your suitcase. All right, let's see what else. How about a little, let's go with this hot pink. Look at that. Beautiful, right? So again, really easy to use. If you want it a little bit more opaque, like I did here, more intense with color, use a little bit less water or you can layer the paint. So you can add a little bit more paint to it to make it a little bit more intense in color. The hues are 
just beautiful. I'm really, really thrilled about this. So the brush that I just used is the, but look at, look at it again, look at how small it is. So this set, you guys, is really small. So cute. Really nice. I, you know, I, I did this one and I'm just doing this one and I barely used anything. Pretty amazing. Again, you get all of this and then I got the postcard separate, which I really love too. So I highly recommend these gravy products. Okay. Thanks for watching.